Hey guys, Rick Hogg with Warhog Tactical and I just want to go over some of Safari Land products that we have out here today. So really, first and foremost, I think one of the interesting things that Safari Land has is their quick locking system. And I just want to give you a quick demo. So when you look on my belt here, you notice there's no holster sitting there. So what makes it nice for me as an instructor is if I need to take my holster on or off or swap between firearms or whatever the case may be, the Safari Land quick locking system gives me that capability. So when you look on the back here, I can easily go and clip that holster right in there. So this one here happens to be set up for a light. If I had a non-light model, no problem. We happen to have one. I can hit the release, easily slide this up, and then I can go to a non-light system and place it on there. Nice thing is too, also have the ALS locking system on there, so it keeps my firearm retained in there. But again, I think the key part is with the quick locking system is now, yes, these are both Safari Land holsters, but really when you put it on a non-Safari Land holster, it gives people other options. So this holster here just happens to have the same cutout pattern is the quick locking system. So now I can put it on there and it gives me the ability to use the same Safari Land setup and now if I have a certain firearm which needs a special holster, whatever the case may be, I've got the ability to put that on there. So it's a really great feature that Safari Land offers, plus the quick locking system is something they offer, so you can buy that in its own and put it on your own holster system. So just kind of looking at some of the other Safari Land systems we have. So if you notice with this particular holster here, yes, it's kind of a drop down leg. Um, you notice it still has the same ALS type system, but they have added kind of that thumb protection is just a little added layer of security for the user. And then an interesting thing with this one is you can see where it's hooked up to actually be a paddle type deal. So now I could actually just clip it on to my belt and now I still have a drop down style holster. And as always, they've got your leg attachment on there. Looking at, again, another one of their holsters. Same thing, kind of has your pancake style where I can sit there and clip it onto your belt. However, what Safari Land has done is they've also included in this particular model, another kind of belt attaching system. So really just by undoing the bolts in the back, replace the new ones. Now I can just go back and forth depending on which way I like to run my holster on my belt. And again, looking at this particular holster, you can see where this one here is just set up straight for your belt. But again, with all your Safari Land products, they're set up in a way where this bolt pattern, where I can mix and match between what I have. And really when you look at here, and then you look at one of their quick lock systems, they're interchangeable. So if I wanted to take this belt loop system off and put my quick lock on, I could. So there's a lot of versatility built in there. And again, has the ALS locking system right there on the top. And then kind of your last one, if you notice here, it's got a little bit different finish on it. So depending on maybe a department or something like that needs a nicer looking, potentially um, holster to fit their duty gear. Safari Land has certainly done that with this setup. Again, same thing on the belt loop system on the back, ALS locking on the top. And again, it's set up for the light, so if you need it. So again, if you kind of look at the different Safari Land products out there, you just need to kind of go through, look at what you're running, whether you're running some type of belt holster, you need a drop down leg. The ALS is a phenomenal locking system. So guys, go check out Safari Land for whatever you need for your holster needs.